Good morning, Bulldogs, and welcome to the Max Morning Show. I'm Faith. And I'm Marin. And today is Friday the 20th of November. Here's your morning weather report. Tomorrow will be partly cloudy with a high of 59 and a low of 35. The sun rose this morning at 7.08 a.m. and will set this evening at 4.45. The lunch money for today is... Cheeseburger macaroni with the roll and garden salad, orange chicken, buffalo chicken pizza, and nachos or tacos. Today's fresh fruit is red seedless grapes. Grape carbohydrates are slowly digested so the energy you get from the grapes lasts longer. Students celebrating their birthdays today are Yuli Sante Zappet, Gracie Dalton, Samuel DeYoung, and Ian Forrest. Now for some announcements from our teachers and office staff. Coin Wars are here. Make sure to bring in all your extra couch coins and other changed and fill up your team's coin jars. Don't forget you can also add paper money to another team's jars to deduct from their totals. The East Coast trip is hosting a screening of the Return of the Jedi in the LGI on the 4th of December from 5.30 to 8.30 p.m. The cost is $5 per person and includes a movie, a candy bar, popcorn, and soda. All proceeds from the event will go to help raise money to send students to Washington, D.C. in the summer. The lost and found in the cafeteria will be cleaned out next Wednesday. Check it out before it all gets donated. Today is Duck and Beaver Day. Hopefully you're wearing your Duck or Beaver best. You can also get points for wearing black and gold. Go Ducks! No, go Beavers! What? No! Okay. <laughs> now for our segment on This Day in History. The following events all took place on today's date, the 20th of November. In 1789, New Jersey became the first state to ratify the Bill of Rights. In 1910, Francisco Ma <laughs> Madero <laughs> became the first, began an armed revolt against the President of Mexico. And in 1947, the future Queen Elizabeth II married Philip Mountbatten, Duke of Edinburgh. And finally, in 1962, President John F. Kennedy agreed to lift the American blockade of Cuba, in d ending the Cuban Missile Crisis. Here it is, your Bulldog Bite of the Day. On our last show, we asked, which plant has the largest seeds? The answer is palm trees. Their coconuts are the largest seeds in the world. Today's question is, fearing that young boys might not read a book written by a woman, her publishers demanded that she use two initials rather than her f first full name. Who is this successful writer? The answer on our next show. Well, that's our show for today. Tune in Monday and every day for the Mac Morning Show. Have a great day. The wind whistles. Okay. In 1910, <laughs> Francisco Madero became the, began an armed revolt against the president of Mexico. In 1947, the future Queen Elizabeth II married Philip Mountbatten, Duke of Edinburgh. <laughs> Agreed to lift the American blockade of Cuba, ending the Cuban Missile Crisis. Here it is, your Bulldog Bite of the Day. On our last show, we asked, which plant has the largest seeds? The answer is palm trees. Their coconuts are the largest seeds in the world. Today's question is, <laughs> fearing that young boys might not read a book written by a woman, her publishers demanded that she use two initials rather than her first full name. Who is this successful writer? the answer on our next show. Well, that's our show. Tune in Monday and every day for the Mac Morning Show. Have a great day. Let's...